once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home lair with their papa wolf. They all lived happily together, but one day, hunters took their dad away. Forever. So now the brothers were alone, and they had to find a new home. They started a journey through the great big forest. The wolf brothers wandered for days and nights, learning how to live on their own for the first time. They slept in the backwoods among creepy creatures and barely ate anything. They eventually found a peaceful orchard and were able to eat in peace. But they didn't know. Hunters tried to tie them up, but the wolf brothers managed to escape with the help of a friendly bear. He showed them how to survive and helped them find a warm camp for the night. That's when the big brother discovered that the little one was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. That's how they found themselves even further, headed to the faraway land of their pop, where they hope to find peace. It was too heavy for you a few days ago. Let's try to lift something else. Not too heavy, though. I'm a little tired. How about trying out that rock over there? Just one more time. We already tried yesterday. And the day before. It's too far. I can't reach it. Just... One more time. How about that one? I can do it with the small rocks, but not the big ones. You can do this. Trust me. Just relax. Focus. I'll try. I did it! <laughs> like a boss. You're getting good at you this. You see that mushroom? That was the biggest rock ever. Oh. 
How about those cans? Can you fly them all together without dropping any? Sure. Look. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. You're getting way better at this. <laughs> Come on, dude. That's just the start. Let's try something else. Cool. You're like Coach Aaron. You're my power coach. A snowball fight? Not yet. This is a new exercise, young apprentice. See if you can stop this in the air. Cool? Okay, but you better not hit me. Like that time you gave me a bruise? Serious. You won't let me, right? Try it. Ready? <gasps> yes! Look! Look what I can do, Sean! I knew that you could. I've taught you well. But you... You're a master student. <coughs> hey... That still sounds nasty. <coughs> You're not getting better. I told you. I'm fine. Just... A little beat. Well, you need to rest now. Superhero. Can we go back now? Yeah. Let's just fill up the canteens before we head back. <laughs> that cough has been going on for days, Daniel. I really don't like that. I told you. I'm fine. We've just been outside for a while. Here we go. The Hella Tanker is over the wildfire zone. Get ready for water extraction. Ranger Diaz. Nice work, Daniel. Glad to see our training sessions are paying off. Thanks to you. So glad I don't have to touch that water. It's too fucking cold. Oops. Sorry. I said fucking. <laughs> it's fine out here. There's no one to hear you curse. Say whatever the fuck you want. Cool. What, what did you find, Shroom? The family who owned that cabin really seemed to enjoy themselves here. Why never come back? Finding that house was a miracle, but I'm afraid we can't stay here much longer. You can't really name Birch, right? Probably the name of a child who used to live here. Good doggy. <laughs> I train Daniel. Daniel can train Shroom. Hey, Enano. Shroom needs some exercise too, right? <laughs> Daniel's getting cold. Daniel helps me slice wood by holding the logs with his power. Pretty useful. Too bad this wood is rotten. We had to cut some more to keep the house warm. Fucking miracle we found this place three weeks ago. Wanna fetch mushroom? Huh? There you go! <laughs> Get it! Go, girl! Must have been a really sweet spot to get a tan in the summer.
Yeah, not my kind of weeds. We really nailed it with this two-headed snow ogre. Hey, what's that? Looks like a box or something. Yo, Daniel! Come here! What's up? Can you fly that box... down from the tree? Duh. Watch me. Sean? The family that lived here... What do you think happened to them? They... must have moved out. Maybe to another state. But... they left all their stuff behind? I don't know, man. Maybe they live in Florida and only come here every ten years. Maybe they got tired of these woods. Well... I'm glad they left. This is our lair now. I just... I miss my friends. And my room. Sometimes. Yeah. Me too. Let's check this out. Yeah, what's inside? Let's see. Uh... Cardboard caps. Badges. Is that... A power bear? But... He's wearing a different costume. Maybe an old design? Awesome! Can we keep it? Sure. That's pretty old school cool. Sorry guys. We don't take any more guests. Runaway Millennials, and part-time forest squatters, at your service. How old are these kids today? What kind of dog were you, Sandy? A cool stray mutt like our little mushroom? Yep. Know me tonight. Hey, maybe we could have another dog. So he can keep mushroom company. Oh, that'd be so cool. No thanks. I don't need a third puppy right now. Daniel's not getting any better. He needs medicine. And a real house. So cold. A proper wind. <sighs> I feel like this month has just flied over us. We're so lucky we found that old cabin. Gave us time to rest and process all that happened. Brody was right. We're stronger now. We look out for each other. We're in this together. These woods are so peaceful. So quiet. No plains, no highways. Just the river. Continuously flowing. we could stay here longer. But Daniel's health is getting worse every day. And the food is running low. Will we need to move? Again?
Ooh, cold. Don't worry. We'll make a fire. We're pros now. <coughs> Dude, that cough doesn't sound too good. Uh, I'm okay. Just cold. You kicked ass today. Level up. I did. That was so cool. It's getting easier every day. Oh no, Sean. This is a haunted house. More like, uh-oh, it's time to go over the rules. I told you about showing off. I was just... Whatever. Dude, I know the rules. Let's find out. What's the first one? Uh, um... Hide your power. If you spin one plate in a diner, what happens? People will freak out. And when people freak, what do they do? They call the cops. Exactly. The second rule is... Don't, uh... Never talk about it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> nice, Daniel. Because that's usually the hardest rule for you. <sighs> Shut up. <laughs> and the final rule? I know... Come on. Um... You can do it. Okay. Um... Avoid danger? Run from danger. This is the most important one. You know why? Uh... I don't know. I mean, with my power I can help us. Only as a total last resort. How will I know that? If there's any other way of helping, do that first. Maybe if I... I'd used it before. Dad might still be here. Daniel, it's my fault. I shouldn't have let you alone outside. But I didn't help. I didn't do anything. Because you couldn't. Mushroom. I'm okay. Good puppy. She must be hungry. What about you? I'm always hungry. <laughs> then let's grub out. I'll make us some dinner. <laughs> yeah. Before she eats us. <laughs> Mushroom clung to Daniel on the first nights. But now she loves her pet by the fire. Daniel needs a doggo friend. Ready for today's training, puppy? <laughs> sit. Shroom, sit. Seriously, girl. Sit. Mushroom, sit, girl. Are you kidding me? You just don't know how to talk to her. I'll remember this, traitor. Thank God kids used to spend vacations here. Daniel would have been mad without these. The guy who came here sure had time to kill. He's definitely a fast learner. Maybe too fast. Mecha robot ready for takeoff. Three. Kinda weird to use stranger stuff every day, but not like we have a choice. I hate it when I hear Daniel crying at night. I can't do shit. We scored with these clothes. Plus five street cred. Oh, the space scuba is hovering on. Hey, Shroom. You thirsty? <laughs> Good girl. What? 
sadistic scene do you have? Kenny must have been pissed that day. Don't blame him. I wish I helped Dad more with the house chores back then. Poor guy. I guess kids have to grow up anyway, right? Wish I had more than tobacco, to be honest. HQ, I'm flying over. There was the a city. little bit left when we came. Copy? Pretty disgusting, but helps staying warm. Put my lighter. Yep, no more indoor training sessions. Feels almost good to be cut off from everything. We never found the key to this door. I guess using the sliding door is cool. Pro tip, always boil the water. Unless you want Daniel spraying nasty things on both ends. Hello, motel room soap. No way I can give any of these to Daniel. Too risky. Once you get used to squatting, it's not so bad. It feels weird to loot other people's clothes, but... We need the warmth. Hey, I put some clean water in the bathroom so you can wash a little. No more peeing at night for Daniel. He got so scared. We're lucky he didn't blow up the house. This is rank. Sharing with Daniel was the worst. This room is fucking cold, so we put everything we didn't need in it and keep it closed. Gotta love one-hit wonders. Thanks, Hank. Dickhead. Yeah. Daniel doesn't need to see this. Of course. He's the town fuck. How can I feel bad for him? <sighs> no excuse not to binge read. Of course. He's the town fucking hero now. How can I feel bad for him? Wonder where Brody is now. Oh yeah, no internet. Dead for a week. But at least we got some news. I'm used to ink, so... This will be different. Time to get warm. Here we go. Hold on, Mushroom. We're gonna build a fire. <laughs> Dang, I am starving. Guess it's time to start cooking. Yum. Too bad I can't make a pizza fly to us. Mmm. I could start Tough doing choice. Your delivery service. This hot Better dog talk to Daniel after dinner. I'm the weird. 
Hey, what are you cooking? Oh, I'm sorry. <coughs> Here's your menu choices. Ravioli or ravioli. Okay, okay. <sighs> Never eating this again. Daniel needs to eat something after all that psychic crap. <sighs> it's warming up. <sighs> Feels so good. I wish we had a big fireplace. Like in Seattle. Remember? Of course I remember. You always got sick on s'mores and ruined the toilet. Yeah. I miss that time. I know. We're so lucky this thing is still working. Wouldn't have lasted long without E. Strong I'm getting soon. Dude, you'll be moving cars around in no time if you keep improving like that. Mm, you really think so? Well, that'd be a bad idea, but you sure are getting good at this. I wonder if there's anyone else like me. Mm, I think we'd know it by now. He looks so serious on this picture. I still can't believe he's gone. I miss him so much, it hurts, Sean. I know, Daniel. It's okay to think about him. I do it too. Okay. Thanks, Sean. to draw this. <sighs> Time to take the pen, dude. Hmm. Pretty good. But I can add more details if I want. <sighs> okay. Got it. I've looked enough. Time to draw now. Come on, girl. Let's get back in. <sighs> okay, dinner's ready. Getting sick of ravioli. This is real food. It's better than nothing. I'm just tired of the same thing. Do you want it, mushroom? Bon Appetit Mushroom. Man, she loves this stuff. <coughs> so 
sorry. I'm cool. <sighs> Hold on. I need to show you something. Um, okay. Gotta show him the map. I think I left it with my books. Mm. Nothing here. Daniel, what did you do with the map? What do you mean? You know what I mean. Where's the map that was with my stuff? Oh, this map. It's in my tent. Sorry, Sean. No way I'm touching that. Okay, come on, doggy. Let's go, girl. Hey, man. Can you call your dog? I don't exist. Mushroom, come here, girl. What a great team. Hmm. I could do a super cool manga about Daniel. Hmm. Man, I miss listening to music so fucking much. <laughs> Daniel loves his brand new tablet. Hmm. Time to play dad talk. What the? When did he show up, mother? Daniel? <laughs> Got you. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Good job. Okay. I think it's time for us to hit the road. You're not getting better. We're almost out of supplies. No. I'm okay. <coughs> it's just a cough. Yeah, a bad cough that won't go away. <sighs> Trust me, Daniel. You need some medicine. Look. Here. Beaver Creek? What's that? That's where Karen's parents... Our grandparents live. Okay. So what? So we can go there and... They'll probably help us. Why do you always force us to run, Sean? What if they... don't like me? They're family, right? Plus they owe us for what Karen... for what Mom did. Um... You sure? It would be cool to spend Christmas with our grandparents. Man, they're gonna love you. Grandpa's super cool and... I'm sure you guys will be best buds. Well... Okay. But Mushroom has to agree too. She's part of the team. What do you say, girl? <laughs> Okay, when? Tomorrow. The sooner the better. We have a long road ahead. Hmm. We should do something fun for our last night here. How about a game of dice? If I win, I get to draw on your backpack. You know I'm gonna win and draw a dick on your bag, right? <laughs> I don't think so, pussy. Party time. Okay. Ready to lose, Captain? Watch your butt, matey. Here we go. Just need a six, a five, and a four. Oh, shit. No crew. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> Ahoy, Captain. Ahoy. Now we just need a fort to get a crew. Still incomplete? Jeez. Sounds like a no score. This is my last chance. Don't fail me. Yay. No full ship. No score. All right. Your turn. Yes, full ship. Yeah, yeah. Good job. I need the score now. Pretty please. Mm, okay, that will do. Pretty good. Okay, let me throw now. Complete ship. <laughs> what the hell? We'll see. I wonder what we would have done if we didn't find these dice. I don't know. Probably read all these books. Huh. Boring. You remember that time I beat Dad at chess? You mean, we beat Dad. Yeah, you did help me distract them. <laughs> I bet he would have liked this game. Definitely. He was a great pirate. Just like us. Captain Diaz, King of the Seas. What? Come on. Sit, please. All right, everyone on deck. Do you think Grandma and Grandpa... And I win. Do you know what it means? <sighs> yeah, okay. You want it. Here's my bag. Mmm, let's see. Here, what do you think? <laughs> Is that mushroom? Yes! I know I'm not as good as you, but... Nah, it's... It's really cool, dude. Thanks. So, let's do another one? It's bedtime. Gotta get up early. I'm gonna finish my comic book. She has to pee. Okay, okay. I'll take her out for a walk. You're going to smoke. Smells like ass. You're right. Don't smoke. But it's our last night, so we can do anything. All right, all right. I heard you the first time, dude. Thank you. 
Hey, Daniel. How are you doing? It sucks. I'm coming. Mushroom wants to go out. Don't you hear? Yeah, sorry. Move! So, what's going on? It doesn't fit in. There's too much stuff. It's fucking bullshit. Hey, cool down. It's gonna be okay. I know, but... What did you pack in? What the f... Dude, you can't fit the whole room in. Don't worry. Your super strong big brother can help. <laughs> awesome. Thanks, Sean. Well, looks like we're almost set. Where's Mushroom? Still peeing, I guess? I'm gonna check what she's up to. <sighs> okay, I'll fill up our bottles and I'll catch up with you guys. Okay, all done. Where the hell is he? Daniel! Daniel! Hey, you out here? Daniel! Where is he? We have a two-day walk ahead of us. Better get going. What the fuck happened here? <sighs> That's not good. I'm so sorry. It just wouldn't have changed anything to kill it. I'm right here. It's all right.
Here. You should do it. That's it. It's bullshit. I can't even bury her. Well, unless you want to say something. Uh, goodbye, Mushroom. You were such a good puppy. I'll always remember. Running through the snow with you. And how you... You snuggled, and I'll never forget you. Never. Thank you, Mushroom, for looking after us in these woods. You won't be forgotten. Sean, do you think she's up in heaven? With Dad? Yeah. I'm sure he will look after her. Wait. What about his allergies? <sighs> Don't worry, Inanna. There's no allergies up there. They'll be fine together. <sighs> okay. We should go. It's getting late. Okay. didn't have to go. I like having a house again. Come on. Let's hit the road. What about my traps? Should we leave them up? <sighs> They'll protect the next runaways to stay here. I put both you in charge of the house mushroom. <laughs> so long, my dudes. Thank you.